moving parasites where people always recommend that they see a doctor because you cannot, you can't help everybody. Um, you can't solve all their problems because most likely they have some kind of physical problem going on as well. And I do tell people this, it's, it's very important. All right. Um, pain in certain areas for no reason or what's seeming to be no reason, just like sharp jabs in your body, like, ow, you know, like something just bit me kind of feeling, and then it goes away. That's a good one. And then just random pains in your body. That can also be implants. Like if you had knee pain or like a pain in your back and there doesn't seem to be any reason there. You've been to a doctor, you've been to a chiropractor, but they have nothing they can do. It's probably an implant stuck in your back or some kind of parasite. Okay. Um, you can see them with your, with your eyes, physical or third eye. So that little, that conscious plate, half asleep, unconscious, conscious place in between asleep and awake is when I, I would see parasites um, when I was younger and not know what they were. I would see them like crawling on the walls, um, crawling um, near my bed, on my bed, like especially the spider ones. And I must be doing a good job of cleansing because I have not seen them in a very long time. <laughs> That's the importance of it. Uh, but like that little that little space in between half awake, half asleep, they, they usually show up when you see them with your physical eyes. And sometimes you can see them at the corner of your eye too. Like at the corner, you see something move and you're like, what was that? That could have been a parasite, all right? Not just a ghost. Although it definitely could be a ghost too. Um, just the feeling that something is there watching you. They do have a consciousness and they do have thoughts. And sometimes when you take them out, you can kind of tap into this. Like they're like, no, 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 no. Like, they, like, you know, distress. You gotta tap into distress. But who gives a shit? They're nasty, so whatever. Stomach problems that can be resolved in other ways. That can't be resolved in other ways. Yeah, we already talked about that. Energetic blocks. So energetic blocks, like, uh, for example, like, I don't know, in your throat or in your heart. Things that you can't seem to, to get through or get past. That could be caused by parasites. Or implants, okay, either one. Oh, I love this one. Being jolted awake by movement on or around you. <laughs> That's a good indication that something is crawling on you, touching you, and you swear you felt something. You swear you felt something move on your skin or touch you. That could be a parasite. That could be especially one of the spider ones or the scorpion parasites just like crawling around you. All right you can feel them and nighttime when you're asleep is like they're kind of like bed bugs you know like they come out when you're asleep that's when they come out and um just have a feast buffet of you yeah. all right let me check the comments you guys have any 